The rhetoric brain's effects are worsening. We must proceed with caution. There! Another wounded soldier. The streams are stabilizing. I don't feel anything unusual about him. He's not a phantom. Let's go help him out. Are you... Are you Yang Yang? Oh, thank goodness. What happened here? The thundering Mephis. It came back. I'm... I'm part of the Deso Rock Highland Supply Transport Team. This is where our supply station is. We work to keep our soldiers alive. We were on our way. Had to go through this... Tacit field, thundering Mephis. The rain brought it back to life, crushing our transport. In the end, I barely escaped. I can't move anymore. This place is dangerous. Careful, please. Watch out! It's him, General... Thundering Mephis. We must bring it down to keep pushing forward. Retreat to advance. Hide the time. Set. Time to fight back. Why don't you worry? Tell truth from the sun. Let me be your blade. Storm, hear the command. Catherine! Speeding up. Hey! Huh. Hey! Huh. Ready for battle. Tell truth on the side. One of the sounds. Be gone! We did it! The thundering Mephis is a blend of countless fallen soldiers' reverberations. As long as more soldiers are still dying here, it will always return. Not to mention, countless souls of our brave soldiers remain trapped in this rain to this day. General. Sorry. I should have arrived sooner. The honor is mine, Rover. Madam Magistrate and Tao Chi have informed me of your willingness to assist us. Thank you for lending us a hand. I should properly welcome you with Huang Lone's formalities, but as the current situation forbids that, I'll brief you on our plans as fast as possible. I've heard about your deeds from Madam Magistrate. You are a trustworthy ally, according to her. Here, Retroact Rain Antidote, developed by the Academy. While the antidote cannot shield you from its effects entirely, it should at least lessen the hallucinations. For someone to show up as a phantom in the Retroact Rain, two conditions must be met. 
prior exposure to the rain, and a deep connection to the affected area. You were found in the Gorges of Spirits only recently, and this is your first time setting foot in Jinjo, ruling out that possibility. Moreover, you possess a similar ability with the legendary hero who once absorbed Thrinodian. Jue prophesied about your arrival. I was told you'd come to the Norfall Barrens one day to reclaim your lost power from Overthrax. I'll do everything in my power to help you make that happen. Yes. Madam Magistrate might not be aware of this as it happened before she was appointed. On the day I was selected to be the next general, Jue told me this. Beneath the full moon, guide the returning one to confront Thrinodian. From the threat itself, he shall reclaim the power to conquer it. And if you are indeed the returning one mentioned here, we may actually get rid of that monster once and for all. You might have noticed something off about that moon. We call it the Void Plenilune. Once it fully takes shape, Overthrax, the Thrinodian of War, would be reawakening soon. It is an ancient terror that reigns over our land, capable of devouring weapon frequencies to enhance itself. The Norfall Barons have become a massive graveyard of weapons after countless battles. Those weapons would have made it even stronger than before. But we must act now. The Void Plenilune is already visible. We must contain the Thrinodian swiftly. Any delay could allow it to recover and become harder to deal with. To remain calm in such an extreme situation, your composure is admirable indeed. We'll get into the specifics once we reach our base. I've taken care of all the tacit discords nearby on my way here. The path ahead should be relatively safe now. Keep going and we'll reach the base soon. One of the sounds. Ready for battle. Tell truth from the song. Overthrax's towering statue, built from repurposed weapons and debris, has long loomed over Jinjo as a foreboding symbol of our ongoing struggle. We managed to gravely injure it three years ago, making the statue sink into the water. And now it just resurfaced. Our enemy must be eager to strike. The Vanguard base is right up ahead. Let's hurry over.
Greetings, General. Master Tianqing? Didn't know I'd be seeing you here. Jianqin recently arrived at our base with one of the supply delivery teams. She has been a great help. <sighs> General, you flatter me. I've heard people comparing the Norfolk Barrens to a massive graveyard. Whenever it rains, cries and moans can be heard as if many ghosts are weeping. Master once told me, life and death should follow a natural course. The heavens and the earth form a vast chamber where spirits freely depart and return. Countless brave souls have been trapped here by the evil powers of Overthrax. I want to help set them free. Please follow me. Our main goal is to contain the reviving Thronodian, but we must beware of the tacit discords too. They have shown unpredictability in every past battle. The Academy determined they were not native to the Norfall Barons, and instead had been conjured by a mysterious power. After analyzing their behavior, I believe the source of said power is none other than that statue. While the Overthrax is still weakened, we must seize the opportunity to act. With looming danger from the continued onsets of TD outbreaks and many of our units injured and unable to fight, it is crucial to plan our attack wisely. Please, join me in mapping out the strategic plans. I have split all combat units into three factions. The ranged units team will provide fire support from afar, while the infantry team engages in close combat. Lastly, we have the special task force of Rover, Yang Yang, Janshin, and me. Allow me to introduce Kong Lin, leader of the ranged units team. And this is Yue Hui. He's in charge of the infantry team. This is a topographical map of the Norfall Barrens. The Overthrax's power limits our reach. Outrider scouts can't go beyond the Norfall Barrens and Valley Junction. The deepest we ventured was three years ago, when we discovered the suspended ruins in its hinterland. But the terrain is treacherous, narrow and flanked by high cliffs on both sides, leaving only one path for our troops to travel. On the other hand, our enemies must take the same route if they want to attack us. With the Overthrax reorganizing their frequencies and bringing them back, we will face endless waves of attacks. Every time we cut down an enemy, it gains more power. Time is of the essence. We cannot afford a prolonged battle. We must swiftly and safely get our strongest units in the heart of the battlefield, reach that statue, and take down Overthrax in time. Rover, let's plan carefully and use each team's strength to our advantage. First, our ranged units. Armed with long-range weapons, they can strike from a distance. But we need to strategize based on the terrain, topography, and enemy forces. If we manipulate the terrain to our advantage, our strikes will be more effective and cover a larger range. Where should we deploy the ranged units? Deploying our ranged units high above the valleys in advance. This way, they'll provide cover for our close combat forces while staying safe themselves. We'll use their range advantage to the fullest. It's a smart move. Next, the infantry. They have been trained and equipped for close combat. 
The heart of Norfall Valley is our main battleground, where we'll fight our enemies head on. We need to plan our attack wisely. How should the infantry engage enemy targets? Now that the narrow terrain has dictated an inevitable confrontation, the infantry will attack head-on, breaking their line. Then our task force can strike where they're vulnerable. A reasonable choice. Lastly, the special task force. All resonators with powerful abilities, they have superior mobility and combat skills. If the chance arises, they will be responsible for taking down the Overthrax. What should the Special Task Force do? Hmm. Flank tactics aim to avoid direct confrontation and exploit enemy weaknesses to take them down slowly. However, our combat power could be drained by the endless enemy assaults if we don't eliminate the Overthrax in time. We can't afford to prolong engagement. There may be more effective tactics available. What should the Special Task Force do? We'll join our effort to break through their defenses and crush their source of power. This is the only way to completely rout the enemies. It's a risky, but necessary move under our current circumstances. Thank you, Rover. The battle plan is clear. I will now recap our plan. Kong Lin, your team will take the cliffs for fire support. Yuehui, your team will charge enemy lines to pave way for the Special Task Force. Yes, sir! And I'll join Rover, Yang Yang, and Jian Xin to create an opening for our main forces and take down the Thrinodian. Good. Are we all clear on what to do? Our next move is to reclaim the disruptor and break through the ground wave barrier. Rover, do you see that iridescent veil? That's the ground wave barrier. Overthrax set it up to absorb frequencies in the Norfall Barrens without interruption. One of our top priorities now is to protect the disruptor from tacit discord attacks. It's a powerful anti thrinodian weapon from when Jinjo was founded. We need it to break through this barrier. I'll leave it to the professional to explain the details. Greetings, General Jian, Rover. How's the preparation going on your side? We've got good news and bad news. Good news is we've established connection to the disruptor and we're ready to go. Bad news is the disruptor's electric capacitor is damaged. Simply put, it's out of power. Fortunately, there should be a backup power outlet. To use the disruptor, we'll have to repair that outlet first, then wait for a full charge. Any questions? I can. But it takes time. No matter how fast I build it, Jinjo won't be able to hold out that long. Any questions? That's because this ancient disruptor dates back at least to the founding of Jinjo. Creating such a powerful weapon with limited technology back then, whoever did it was truly a genius, I must say. If we were to unleash its full power on Jinjo City, it might launch the entire place into the air. Any questions? 
In theory, we could. In practice, it's difficult. First, it could dodge our attack. Not even a perfect hit can kill it. It will be greatly injured, but not dead. Thronodians have been proven to be way stronger than we imagined. Our disruptor can't handle the Overthrax, but it can certainly break through that barrier. Any questions? By the way, this is a weapon of mass destruction. The capital would want strict control over its use, I assume. Will they really approve our application? The Magistrate and I have it covered. Trust me. All right. We'll be waiting for the green light. Lastly, we've got more bad news. Baija, please fill us in. Yes. Rover, I am currently monitoring the tacit discord attacks from the Academy to design a safer route for you. We just received word from our soldiers at the emplacement. A large number of tacit discords are targeting the disruptor, and our troops are doing their best to defend it. The disruptor has been surrounded by the tacit discords, with more of them slowly closing in. After we recapture the nearby emplacement, it will take some more time for the disruptor to recharge. You may need to hold out a little longer. I'll send you the coordinates of the disruptor and its backup energy port. We wish you the best of luck. I trust we all understand the situation now. Rover, Yang Yang, please go and secure the disruptor and fix its backup energy outlet. Jian Xin, please stay and guard the base. I'll draw those tacit discords away. Let's get moving. General Jian sent us here to help. How are things going? Those monsters have occupied the emplacement with a surprise attack, but a few brave troops are still holding on. We've blocked off access to protect our base, but I'm opening it up for you. Please, they need your help. We're counting on you. It is natural to feel dreadful of the unknown.
General, is that you? <laughs> is that so? Great. We know how important this cannon is. We kept it safe. <laughs> Never let them have it. This reparation key, take it. I may not see our victory in person. But please, please defeat that monster for us. Thank you. is weakening. Hold on just a little longer, Rover. Storm, hear the command! Hot swift and resolute, one with the sound. Moment of resonance. Disruptor's fully charged. Rover, let's take out the remaining task of discords together. Don't worry. Swift and resolute. One with the sound. The hour is upon us. Let me be your blade. Let the winds roar. Swift and resolute. No hesitation. Stopped. General, the Retroact Rain's effects are subsiding. We are observing a sharp decline in the number of TDs in the Norfall Barrens. The Disruptor is fully charged and ready to fire, but... It takes a lot of energy to fire the Disruptor. If we missed... This is our only chance. Greetings. Can you hear me? 
As the Magistrate of Jinjo, I've obtained the approval to use the Disruptor in combat. The enormous energy consumption, the risk of a misfire, and the weight of this decision, I will bear the responsibility. I alone will be accountable for the outcome of this battle, whatever it may be. General, Rover, please march on. May victory prevail the lasting night. I pray for your safe return. Thank you for your trust, Madam Magistrate. No need for that, General. We've always shared the same goal, you and I. Attention all units. Do everything you can to assist. You are authorized to use the disruptor. Target the Norfall Barons. Defend Jinjo at all costs! costs. One o'clock! Watch out! Tassa Discord's incoming! Resolute. There's more of them. Move! We're running out of time! Shake them off! Use your grapple now! Master Tianxin! There's too many of them. Someone must stay behind to keep them at bay. Everyone, let's part ways here. Carry on with your mission. You can leave the rest to me. Yang Yang, Rover, follow me. We're going down from here. Mind the cliff! Rover, are you all right? Stay sharp. More tacit discords incoming. Let me be your blade. Synchronization. Let the winds roar. Ready for battle.
The suspended ruins are ahead of us. The resonance beacon here is still functioning, and the defense feature is intact, too. We can catch our breath here. The Overthrax assault has been as brutal as expected. We've been cut off from our main forces. It's the three of us against all of them from here. Master Tianxing, I hope she's okay. I tried to contact her and our base, but nothing came back. The Thranodian's power is possibly interfering with terminal signals. We have no choice but to trust them now. Let's press on. We're bound to face a vicious fight. We've reached the suspended ruins. We'll get going once you're ready. It's unusually quiet inside. This wall. We should be able to pull it away with our grapple. Every path ahead has been cut off. We're not seeing anything at the moment. Rover, be careful. Something bigger might be waiting for us ahead. Creating a tacit discord at this level. But it won't stop us. The end has come. As expected, the enemies are increasingly strong as we approach the statue. Have you been injured, Rover, Yang Yang? I'm okay, but Rover, he... Give me your hand. <laughs> Knew it. The battle has left you with a few scratches. I still have some first aid with me. Please use them. The upcoming battles will be even more dangerous. Should you get injured, you must let me know in time. Let's keep moving. There are several floating platforms ahead. Perhaps we can make use of them. Ha! 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 
one with the sound. These rocks are blocking our way. We'll need to get rid of them. Finally. Rover, you hear me? Our signals got blocked off by the Thronodian's power. It took us a lot of effort to make this call get through. I have to say, your terminal has a very intriguing design. We'd love to thoroughly investigate it once we have the chance. Now back to business. We are aware of your situation. Luckily, your current location is still within the Disruptor's range. We can provide fire support. You've seen what the Disruptor is capable of. We can turn down the output power, but I strongly advise finding cover far away. The structure of this building is almost entirely destroyed. We'll need to create a safe space where we can take cover. There is a floating platform over there. Perhaps we can make use of it. Aim at that wall. We can pull ourselves over. Mortify, it's time. Understood. Watch out, everyone. We did it. The disruptor's power is down to one third. We can only fire it one more time. After that, it needs to recharge. Take care, everyone. I'm on standby to help you anytime. Did it. The disruptor's power is down to one third. We can only fire it one more time. After that, it needs to recharge. Take care, everyone. I'm on standby to help you anytime. Let's try pulling the floating boulders together. This should make our path ahead. One moment, Rover. We can work the terrain. Same situation. Let's do it again. Permanence Heron. In this place. many enemies along the way. I couldn't have made it past them so fast without you. We're almost there. The statue's power is getting stronger. I can feel it. We don't have much time left. Let's move on.
speeding up. up there but how are we going to climb up i can see a gravity stream ahead it's currently blocked off we'll pull the rocks away first then let it carry us up there more rocks let's remove them once we find a foothold to our endeavor. We have almost reached the top. That giant rock. We've got to remove it somehow. It moved a little. Let's give it a couple more goes. Almost there. <sighs> we finally did it. We'll reach the top soon. 